Oh, come on. Good morning. Women can do better than that. I know it. The kids in the back can do better than that, right? My kids that drove here by yourselves, right? The three boys right there, they drove here by themselves, they said. No, we didn't. Okay, uh, you guys are some of my most important people on campus today. Could you understand the importance of early childhood? In fact, I'm the chairwoman for elementary and secondary ed. I'm the highest ranking Democrat with the most educational background. So my two areas, I, I go from, I say education starts at zero in the womb all the way to grade 20, okay? But what we've forgotten is that the most important time in a child's development in life is where you guys are at. You guys are some extremely important people on the planet to me because you deal with the kids and lay the foundation down that they need to succeed in life in college. And if we don't do it when they're young, then they don't get it when they go on to college. They drop out of school. They can't get into school. And you're talking to somebody who I failed third grade, was told I was stupid, stay home in eighth grade, scored a 17 on ACT, got into the chance program, a backdoor at Northern, and I'm in charge of education in the state of Illinois. So that's the opportunity you guys have. No, that's, that's the opportunity God has given you guys to mentor these children into amazing people. Uh, your job, you are teachers. Regardless of what your certification is, you each one of you are teachers. And you wouldn't be where you're at had you not had a phenomenal teacher to encourage you, okay? Understand the, the impact there. The one thing that you can rely on that somebody in Switzerland or Finland or Africa, it doesn't matter where you're at in this world, is that they all had the same key element, a teacher, to help them and inspire them. And that's what you guys are to me, and that's why you're so important. But today is about making sure every one of the representatives under the dome and senators understand how important your job is to the vitality and the economic growth of this state. Because if someone says education's not important, then they're saying the whole entire economy is not important. Because you guys are the first people on the line to make sure whatever mom and dad is not providing for them in the house, you are providing for them in the classrooms, right? Every day. And have patience with my little people. I know I had two at once. Not at the same time, I have two that were littler. Now they're 12 and 15, they've grown up a little bit. Um, and thank God for my husband, because he's been a great mommy daddy when I'm not around. But you guys affect change throughout the world. It's that one kid that you give possibility and hope to every day that can say, that person believes in me, and I know I can do better, regardless of what their household has. You guys have that awesome responsibility. Now, if you want to stay in business, and I want you to stay in business, your awesome responsibility today is to knock on doors, get as many state representatives as you can to talk to, and as many senators as you can to talk to about the appropriation levels in the state of Illinois and the adequacy we do with education, early education. There's two bills that passed out, one today that dropped the compulsory age to um, seven, wait, to six. Was it six? It's um, Shears' bill. So we're trying to drop the age so it's mandated that the kids start a year earlier. We want two, but we'll take one. Baby steps down here. But now we have to find the resources and dollars to make sure everybody's covered, okay? And we're talking every baby in the state of Illinois, um, and we know how important that is. So you have an awesome, awesome, awesome responsibility, women and men, if there's any men. Are there any men in the crowd? I don't want to dog you out. One got two guys, three guys, four guys. Four guys? Thank God for you. You get it. Could you tell the rest of your, your, gen, your, your gene pool that it's important that you listen to us? Because don't forget, women, just how powerful we are, okay? The man might wear the pants in the household, but we buy them, wash them, iron them, put them on the bed. Preach him. Anyway, if there's a doubt in the mind that I don't love you, there should be no doubt now. I need you. I need your help. I will stand behind you. I will support you. Anything I need to do to make sure that you double in size and we need to do in this state what we need to do for the children in the state of Illinois for our future it depends on you guys and that's how important you are to me and someday we need to make sure that you're funded and your salaries uh, reflect that too that's another day another discussion but if you fight with me we'll keep on fighting for that too have a great day